We're just days away from a historic night in the capital city. The Sacramento Kings are back in the playoffs for the first time in almost two decades. Tickets for Game 1 against the Golden State Warriors went on sale today. And listen to this. The tickets for Game 1 are expected to be the most expensive for any first-round playoff game ever. Oh, yeah. And the cheapest tickets that we could find were around $450 apiece. And that is just to get you in the door. But for some fans, price or distance really don't matter. So ABC 10's <laughs> Luke Clary is here now. And Luke, you spoke to some fans on the other side of the country tonight. Yeah, that's right, guys. And uh, they told me that it didn't matter what the cost. They just had to be there. Light the beam, baby. Light the beam. She works in Washington politics. Kings in four, light the beam. He's a New York City comedian. Both loyal Kings fans through and through. And among the thousands of fans who will pack Golden One Center Saturday for the team's first playoff appearance in 16 NBA seasons. The fun is getting drilled into the ground for 16 years straight, so now we can celebrate. And so now, to be there, it feels euphoric almost. Before Hannah Muldaven was a spokesperson for the January 6th committee in Washington, she was the kid in overalls in this shop with one of the Maloof brothers, the former owners of the Kings. You know, I was at the 2002 Western Conference Final Game 7 when we lost to the Lakers, and I was, I was little, but I remember leaving that building and feeling so upset. Still, those were the glory days. This is the Kings starting lineup minus Chris Webber. Stand-up comic Turner Sparks was once a toddler watching from the aisles of Arco Arena. 1985, since when they moved to Sacramento, I was three years old and my dad got season tickets the first year and would sneak me in. She's planning on going with her dad. He's going with his brother and their dad getting those tickets a struggle. When I was on Ticketmaster trying to get tickets, I had a big flashback to getting Taylor Swift tickets. Way overpriced. And to be honest, I'm not even 100% sure we have the tickets. StubHub says we do, but they haven't been delivered to us yet. So. Fans justifying those eye-popping ticket prices as a celebration of a playoff drought coming to an end. We figured the, the amount of money we've saved over the last 17 years by not going to these playoff games, we can now spend on the games. Maybe we should try to fix ticket sales on a larger level, but um, it, it's heartening because it shows how much Kings fans want this, but it's, it's really tough for some of those people that you know have been there this whole time and might not be able to afford it. Two fans among thousands of Sac Towns loyalists looking for a Golden State beatdown. That's all we've heard about for the last decade is like Warriors, 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 Curry, 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 Curry. Finally, we have a team, Young, that's going to dethrone them and then they'll be, they'll all become Kings fans again like they were in 2002. Sports, that's one of the areas where Democrats and Republicans can sit side by side. Yeah, we just hate the Warriors. We hate the other team. Um, that's, the hate is just directed at a city and fan base versus, you know, your, your uncle at Thanksgiving, right? <laughs> Good point. Now, if you wanted to buy a ticket at cost, you'll have to wait in the queue, which has been at times thousands of people long. And all the tickets that you will see here on Ticketmaster, these are verified resale tickets coming from another fan. So way up in the nosebleeds here, we can see in the last row, there are tickets available for $686. But let's say you wanted to sit courtside. What would that experience set you back? Here are a couple of tickets right up in the front row at $10,000 a pop. That's close to a down payment on a home, but hey, at least food and drink come with, so you'll save a few bucks on popcorn. And just one last thing, here's an article one of our digital producers wrote back in January of 2022, back when you could get tickets to a Kings game for less than the cost of a gallon wow. of California <sighs> gas, five bucks a pop. Wow. Can you imagine that? Oh, how about from talk that about perspective? The, I'm telling you, talk about the difference a few years makes, huh? Oh, my gosh. It is a family affair for some <laughs> fans, though. So save up your pennies, right? Our Luke Clary in the studio for us tonight. Luke, thank you.